My name is Riley, Riley's Little Space, his little space, or whatever you know me as. And today I am here with you to film a review video. I got one of the new top of the line diapers on the market a little while ago, and I figured I would review it for those of you who are interested in diapers, who are curious about this particular one and want to know my thoughts on it. And judging by the title, you already know the diaper that I am going to be reviewing today is the AB Universe Peekaboo. This is just one of the designs. There are four different designs in the pack. There's the raccoon, which is this one. There's a little wolf, there's the giraffe, and there's a dragon. As far as the design goes, I give it a five out of five. It is really cute, it is simple, it is very babyish. It is all plain white except for the landing strip. The art on it is super cute and it is very original to ABU and ABU's designs. And this is also the first diaper of its style in its kind. It has a quilted inside to it and the absorbency is upwards of 6,500 milliliters, which for diapers is a lot. Before that, the highest on the market was a little under 5,500 milliliters, so at 6,500 milliliters, this definitely beats out the competition. As far as the actual fit of the diaper goes, I only give it a one out of five. The reasoning is because they say it's the same as the rest of ABU sizing, but as somebody who wears a large ABU normally in the space and little paws, we ordered a large of the peak ABU and they fit significantly smaller. They fit more along the lines of a my diaper or a Dotty the Pony than an ABU. Had we known that, I would have ordered an extra large because they would have fit better and been a lot more comfortable. But ABU does not mention at all on their website anywhere that the sizing runs differently, but it does. The sizing runs smaller compared to the normal ABU sizing, so just make sure you keep that in mind. A really good friend of mine who is a medium and small in most dips can fit comfortably into a large peak ABU. You. The tapes also have way too much space in between them. I will show you guys here. I don't know if you can see compared to the landing strip. The landing strip only goes to the bottom of here and then it's the regular diaper plastic but I'm looking in the viewfinder so I can tell. You see if you match up the top with the top, the bottom is like two inches too far down. And because of this, when you fit both of them up to the landing strip, it gives you this really weird side pocket here. Or you're putting it on the regular plastic of the diaper, which means you cannot readjust the tapes. However, as I was saying, one of the major redeeming qualities of this diaper is the absorbency. This diaper can last from a good 14 to 16 hours. It beats out Rears and all other brands for being the most absorbent adult diaper on the market, so that is definitely a plus, especially if you are dealing with incontinent issues. And one of the really cool features about this diaper is that it is decently thin, but as it gets wet, it swells a lot. So after it's wet, it might not be the best for discreet everyday wear, but it is very comfortable when wet. It makes you feel very babyish, and it's really nice. For customer service, I am giving ABU a 1 out of 5. We contacted them about the fit and the tape issue, and they just had an automated machine reply no matter how many times we contacted them about the issue. And they pride themselves on being good with customer service, but to us, they never even responded to our questions or concerns. So that is not cool. Overall, I give this diaper a 3 out of 5, but I will say for $200, a case, it is definitely not worth the price point for the issues that it has. I hope you guys enjoyed this review and you learned something from it and take this knowledge with you on your diaper buying journeys. You can follow me on all of my social media at Riley's Little Space and His Little Space. All of the links to take you there directly are in the description below, as well as the links to my other two YouTube channels that I post on regularly. I love you guys oh so so much and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.